So now that we have a fair idea of the mission and its many parts, let's look at its purpose. What does it aim to achieve and how did Chandrayaan-2 embark on this journey? Here's another report. Launched from Sri Harikota in southern India on a 100% Indian rocket, Chandrayaan-2, meaning lunar vehicle in Sanskrit, headed for the unexplored part of the moon, its south pole. The aim was to arrive at the beginning of September 2019 after a voyage of 380,000 kilometers. After placing itself in lunar orbit 100 kilometers above the surface, the spacecraft sent a lander on a controlled descent to the surface. A six-wheeled solar-powered rover released by the lander is to explore about 200 meters of lunar territory. The aim of the 14-day mission, to examine the surface, gathering data on minerals and even water in the form of ice. Eleven years after the Chandrayaan-1 mission, which placed a probe in orbit around the moon, India aims to become the fourth country to send a mission to the moon's surface, after the US, the Soviet Union and China. But India's ambitions don't stop there. They hope the first manned mission to space will take off before 2022.